whole bunch of whole bunch of pastels. Ryo Con, excuse me, Ryo Connor and Alex Licklider. I guess I'm a little allergic to bread here. Ryo Connor and Licklider. So Ryo Connor will lead. Who had a great, great qualifying run. I told him, hey man, great, uh, great job driving the other day. In qualifying, he says thanks. He's really excited about that, and here he is. But uh, will that help or hurt him that he hasn't seen head-to-head -head competition until now? And he's going against Alex Licklider, who took out Rudy Hansen. Rudy Hansen took out himself early on. Here comes Ryle Connor, a swang thing in front of Licklider. Now into the second outside zone. Big angle. Oh, and it bites, and Ryle Connor. So that checks up Licklider. Unfortunately. That will be a deficit and a mistake and an incomplete by Ryo O'Connor. So Licklider will have an advantage. That guy never stops tuning, nonstop, nonstop. They're tuning. tuning his car right now, literally, as he's driving. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's see the replay on that. It looked like um, in the lead position there, uh, Ryo O'Connor over rotated the car. He was way offline for outside zone number two. Uh, you know, quite a bit inside there and stalled to the point where Licklider. Could not get through there. So, in the in the lead position, Rai's doing okay in outside zone one. Licklider is quite a bit inside there. But if you look at right there, had Licklider kept going, he definitely would have Bash plowed up. right into <laughs> O'Connor's car. So yeah. he had to do that to avoid contact, and that uh, that will go on Rai O'Connor for sure. Pretty fly for a Rai guy. For a Rai guy. So in this so situation, we're almost we're taking the incomplete. That you know, visually you look there, uh, Licklider spun and stopped. Um, O'Connor kept going, but that incomplete no. gets transferred from Licklider to O'Connor because O'Connor is the one that caused it. So um, you can't expect a chase car to do anything in that situation. Um, there was nowhere for him to go other than to stop his car like that to avoid a big collision. So uh, Ryo O'Connor does inherit that incomplete. So he'll be going into this next run of battle here with a pretty big deficit. I like how he transferred. It's like it's like like it touched him, like some. Superhero transferred that stall. If you want to be less like supernatural about it, you just like <laughs> handed him something physical, like a piece of paper or something. Hello, good day. <laughs> this, this is, is for this you. Is, this is your deficit. Tip of the hat and mm -hmm. good day. I said good day. And he slapped him with a glove. I don't know where the glove <laughs> came from. All right, here we go. Let's alternate the order. Lick Lighter will be out front. Ryle O'Connor in the chase position. Lick Lighter. Ooh, man, a lot of these guys getting involved in that dirt. These guys want to be gardeners. Real green thumbs around here, green wheels. Licklider into that second outside zone. Ryo Connor tries to keep pace with him. Licklider, he could be getting the victory here if he keeps it. But oh, oh, oh my oh goodness! Oh boy, that is an incomplete. Goodness <laughs> gracious! Oh boy, the that brown cloud came into play. See the brown clouds like woo. The spirit of outside zone one haunted him. Yeah. So this is this forced. Is a forced for, one a more forced time. Forced one more time. That's an incomplete. So Rye got Rye got a gift there. Licklider was on to victory, dude. He saw he was he was spraying champagne to move into the top 16. If there's a top 16 champagne bottles that don't exist, he would be spraying. He'd it. be spraying it. Yeah. So you can see a, a, a tire drop there from Licklider in the lead. He angles up a little bit, but seems to maintain momentum. And then right here leaves outside zone too early. You can see Rye in the chase trying to put on pressure, and he's doing a good job. Licklider fills outside zone three, but then transitions so 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 early oh, no. and slows down too, too much and does not make it around outside zone four, which causes an incomplete. Now, two lead drivers with an incomplete yep. equals an automatic one more time. Because Completely the chase, unscorable. Right. The chase drivers are not um, held at, at fault for anything at that point, but they're also not allowed to keep drifting and the run is essentially over. So in that case, we get a one more time. Unfortunate there. So forced to a OMT. That is a one more time for Ryle O'Connor and Alex Licklider. It was all Licklider, but... All right, well, uh, there's the outcome.